One alternative to repaving low-volume rural roads is a surface treatment called chip seal. A chip seal is a thin layer of fine aggregate embedded in a layer of liquid asphalt cement. For chip seal paving, an excessive amount of minus 200 material adhering to the aggregate leads to an inadequate bond between the chips and the asphalt. In other words, too much dust on the aggregate and it won't stick to the road. In order to diagnose the potential for this problem at the material source, Oklahoma has developed the Percent Dust Coating Test to determine the amount of minus 200 material adhering to aggregate retained on the number 8 sieve. Any more than 1% is too much. For this test, you will need a balance with a capacity readable to one-tenth of a gram, a minimum of two sieves consisting of a number 200 and a number 8, a container large enough to hold the entire sample covered with water and permit vigorous washing without spillage, and an oven capable of maintaining a uniform temperature of 230 plus or minus 9 degrees Fahrenheit. Obtain the sample in accordance with Ashto T2 and reduce to testing size in accordance with Ashto T248. The minimum mass of the test sample is 1,000 grams for aggregate with a nominal maximum size of 3 8 of an inch and 2,000 grams if the nominal maximum size is 1 half inch. Dry the sample to a constant mass at 230 plus or minus 9 degrees Fahrenheit. That's 110 plus or minus 5 degrees Celsius. When the sample is sufficiently dry, allow it to cool to room temperature. Shake the sample over a number 8 sieve. The goal here is to remove the minus 8 material without degrading the coarse particles. Take care not to overload the sieve. Place the material retained on the number 8 sieve into a suitable container. Be sure to tear the container or record its weight first. Record the mass of the material to the nearest tenth of a gram. Wash the sample according to Ashto T11, method A, washing with plain water. When the water is clear, return all material retained on the sieves to the sample container. Dry the sample to a constant mass at 230 plus or minus 9 degrees Fahrenheit. Allow the sample to cool to room temperature. Record the weight of the sample to the nearest tenth of a gram. To set up the calculation formula, we'll call the answer A. The original dry mass before washing, we'll call B. And the final dry mass, the weight after washing and drying, will be C. Calculate the percent dust coating to the nearest 0.1% as follows. Subtract C from B and divide the resulting quantity by B. Then multiply that result by 100 to get the percentage. In this example, the dry mass before washing is 2,039.2 grams. The dry mass after washing is 2,032.0 grams. B minus C equals 7.2 grams. Divided by B equals 0 0.0035 times 100 equals 0 0.3531. To the nearest 0.1%, the result of this test should be reported as 0.4. In this example, the sample passed the ODOT requirement which specifies a percent dust coating between 0 and 1.0%.